If you've been following my vlog, you will recall that I was challenged getting the Acme two dolly straps installed on the Venice's wheels. What we just saw was the Acme strap on the left and the Vulcan strap that I'm going to install on the right. As you can see, the Acme strap is robust. It is designed to secure a 5,000 pound car to the dolly. It has a safe working load of 3,333 pounds. Overkill for the Venice, which tips the scale at 1,300 pounds. The set I'm using today is a Vulcan classic granite style wheel lift harness. With a much simpler design with one strap over the tire. It has a safe working load of 1,665 pounds. It's, I guess, as you can see, it's not going to be any easier to get this on the Venice tire. Tried feeding from the rear. Okay. Well, we've got it again. Securing the strap at the rear of the tire of the dolly. Okay, now we want to get the uh, top strap and the side straps evenly aligned with the wheel. And finally, we're going to feed the front strap through the winch. Now, I was going to use a socket wrench to tighten the strap. However, it seems I don't own a large enough socket, so let's try our old favorite, the crescent wrench. Okay, while I'm tightening this dolly, excuse me, while I'm tightening this strap, uh, you may want to note that I didn't quite get the Venice on the dolly straight. I've got about an inch, inch and a half gap between the tire and the toe rail. So I've decided that uh, I am moving the Venice with the tire straps to the point outside to put the transmission in neutral before I finish tightening the strap. A couple notes about wheel straps. New straps need to settle down. They stretch. The first time you use straps, you want to retighten the straps after towing about 100 feet. Check them again after about 25 miles. If they are noticeably loose at 25 miles, and check them again after another 50 miles. Once the straps have settled in, you should only need to check the straps at each fuel stop. When you remove the straps at the end of your toe, check the straps for wear. Straps are a consumable item. Okay, on to the driver's side. Will this side go on any easier? Nope, just as much for niggling as the passenger side. Wrong. More finagling. Uh, note, by the way, that the tire is up against the uh, stop on this side. Okay, looks like I am finally happy. I'm Fasten this drop at the back of the wheel. Okay. I'm going to winching this down. So the final step in getting this ready is to um, add the safety chains, and then we should be ready to try these out. Now you'll note on these tires that there's a lot less strap engagement with the tire compared to the Acme straps. I was concerned about this, so I sent a picture to the manufacturer. They assured me that the engagement was sufficient. I did this, by the way, prior to making this video. Alright, we're looking good. We've got our safety chains on, we've got our tires strapped down. Driver side also is looking good. Safety strain is around the um, lower part of the of the steering arm. Now I've only towed a short distance with the so far. I've only taken about five miles. It seemed to be adequate. When I do have more miles with the straps, I'll post my experience on my Venice blog at Vanderhall Venice, the very. Dot US.